Candace from Ohio is asking us to rate the shade, so let's go. She says, a friend and I moved in together. We had discussed the details of splitting the bills and what we felt comfortable allowing in the apartment, etc. We had agreed that I would pay two thirds of the rent as I wanted to get a three bedroom. So there was room for my sister and she was struggling and may need it. I didn't mind paying the extra as it was for my sister. Ooh, you a good sister. We also agreed to no male overnight guests. It was all great until she started dating one of my coworkers. They started having sleepovers often. And then I simply asked if they could stay at his place as I didn't feel comfortable waking up to coworkers at our place. Lucky for me, I would totally not mind waking up to my coworkers. Okay, especially as I was a manager over him. Ooh, this is getting weird. She told me she understood I was uncomfortable and had different standards of living, but I was being selfish as she needed him there and it wasn't their fault. He worked for me and she deserved to feel comfortable in our place as well. I responded saying, I wasn't trying to make her uncomfortable, just setting some professional boundaries. I wasn't telling them how to live, just asking when they felt like they like going to bed to head to his place instead. She then told me to stay somewhere else if I was uncomfortable. Some hurtful words were exchanged that I ended up moving out. However, my landlord refused to let me off the lease and I ended up paying the two thirds, the last two months of the lease while also paying for a new place. I have forgiven her and apologized for my role in the fight. I received no response. Is this shade or do I give her time? Girl, the shade isn't for the situation. The shade isn't for the extra rent you paid or the message you sent that you didn't get a reply to. My shade is towards you. Are you out your mind? Why do you even want to be friends with somebody who did that to you? Number one. Number two, you did get a reply. Like I always say, no reply is a reply. That means she's not trying to be your friend. She hasn't forgiven you. And I just can't believe you continue to pay money for an apartment you weren't even staying in. I, I, you, you girl, you're a better person than I am. Cause the shade, I'm, I'm throwing shade at you. Like why in God's name did you pay rent for a place you weren't staying in? And then try to reach out to the girl to ask her for forgiveness and then wonder if you should give her time when she's not responding to you. That ain't your friend. Rude words were exchanged. I love this saying, I saw it on a meme on Instagram and it said, when people shout out rude things in the middle of a fight, trust and believe they've been wanting to say that for a long time. That's not the first time that went through their mind. Oh, they've been harboring those feelings for a good minute. So she meant what she said. And she also means it when she doesn't reply to you. She doesn't want to be your friend. Shade all over.